since we see that huge awesome belt with you so would you like to talk a little bit about it like what it really is and stuff sure sure so as a lot of people are familiar there's lots of wrestling organizations around the world uh the toughest being in japan where it's less on theatrics and more on realism so in the WWE, there's a lot of theatrics, and I'm not knocking WWE or WWF. They're great athletes in what they do, but there's a lot more theatrics, right? It's a big show, it's a big movie, it's a big drama. But in the Japan, uh, they focus less on that. They want the authentic. So in this particular case, I was wrestling in Japan, and I defeated uh, the sumo grand champion at the time. He was about 450 pounds, and uh, yeah. So that's where this world champion was uh, was uh, was achieved. Wow, that's great. So I heard that you have so many foundations and charities, stuff like that. So would you like to talk a little bit about how it all is for you and how it makes you feel awesome about yourself? Yeah, so that's a great question. So um, what I found from all my travels, either doing movies or you know you do wrestling or you appear in commercials, that is only a temporary satisfaction, right? You, got, you get money from it, you buy some cars, you have a nice fancy house. But the fulfillment inside is still unsatisfied. And what I've learned through my life, to satisfy that fulfillment, that missing piece, is when you give to others. So that, that's what we found out through, through charity. We have a Canadian registered charity, the Tiger Jeet Singh Foundation. And that mandate is to help children of all races, all cultures, all ethnicities. So we visit sick kids, McMaster Children's Hospital, Women's Shelter, Salvation Army, and public schools like this, just to raise the awareness of how important it is for us as the human race to come together and support one another. That is great.